welcome to bs payment today i am going to show you a project demo on vehicle tracking system global positioning system tracking is a method of working out exactly where something is a gps tracking system uses the global navigation satellite system aka gnss network this network incorporates a range of satellites that use microwave signals that are transmitted to the gps device to give information on location vehicle speed time and direction let's build our own tracking system using arduino let's see the functional block diagram main component in the system is gps receiver which reads location information from the satellites and the microcontroller will process those data and send the text message using a gsm modem lcd is used for displaying various information during the execution of a program vibration sensor and a carbon monoxide sensor are added as additional features and a 5 volts regulated power supply let's see the circuit diagram it consists of atmega328 microcontroller with arduino bootloader running at 16 megahertz clock and operates at 5 volts power a vibration sensor to detect an accident is connected to the interrupt pin int0 a mq7 sensor to measure a carbon monoxide emitted from the vehicle is connected to the analog channel a not 16 by 2 character lcd is configured in 4 bit mode sim 800a a gsm modem is connected to the uart pins a gps receiver is connected to the gpio pin which emulates the software serial buzzer is used for indications input port of the system is 7.5 volts which is regulated to 5 volts using 780m05 regulator let us see the program as the power is applied to the controller the setup function will be called where all the peripherals are initialized vibration sensor is configured as a rising edge interrupt then lcd is initialized followed by the serial communication for a gsm and gps are initialized timer 1 overflow interrupt is initialized to 100 milliseconds time period where the timer overflow isr will be called then the controller will enter into the sleep mode when the timer overflow occurs the loop function will be called inside which task co monitor will be called it will read the carbon monoxide value and display over the lcd if the value is more than the threshold the location information will be sent in the task accident if the accident is occurred which is detected by the vibration sensor a location information will be sent in the task message if the message is received the system will compare the phone number against the registered number if it is phone match the location information will be sent let's see the send location function the message will be concatenated with the google link and get location function will be called with latitude and longitude as a parameters which eventually contains the location information when the function returns and these values are concatenated with the link and it will send the message make sure to enter your phone number before compiling the sketch you required three libraries to download and install timer 1 software serial and a tiny gps and the program is written in arduino 1.6.12 let's see the hardware it consists of atmega328 microcontroller a 16 by 2 character lcd sim 800a gsm modem a gps receiver which is placed near to the window mq7 carbon monoxide sensor and a vibration sensor input port of the system is 7.5 volts and are regulated to 5 volts using 780m05 regulator let's power on once the power is applied to the controller it will initializes the peripherals once it is done it will monitor the carbon monoxide sensor and display over the lcd let's track the vehicle by sending the sms track the system receives it and send back the location information where the vehicle is located no the message is received your vehicle is located at once you click on the link the google map will open which indicates where the vehicle is located when the accident is occurred the vibration sensor detects it and the location information will be sent accident occurred reset the vehicle now the message is received your vehicle got accident let's check the carbon monoxide sensor when the level of co is more than 6 ppm the system sends the alert information i co to content now the message is received 
circuitagram program and other details are available in the description if you have any doubts in the project leave them in this comment section below guys here is the simple contest what type of interrupt interrupt i have used in the project for a vibration sensor you can win a free volumex development board let me know them in the comment section below the answer should be very specific guys thanks for watching this video if you like please thumbs up and subscribe see you next time that's a background noise see you next time until then don't forget keep learning